Evening, Joe. Evening, Joe. I hope I didn't wake y'all. I know it's after seven, but I got a little problem, so to speak. I don't know how to tell this. I feel a little dumb, but that little dog I had run off last week. Yeah, that bouncing blue-eyed mongrel, you, you know the one I mean. He rides with me and sleeps on Mother's lap. And, well, we got him when the kids left just a year or two ago, and I, I reckon that he sort of fills the gap. Yeah, well, I was up, I was up on Saddle Mountain to scatter out some salt, and he must have fell out when I started home. And I came out down by your place, and uh, you know, if he uh, shows up there, I'd, I'd appreciate a jingle on the phone. Yeah, I know, he really isn't worth much, but Ma got plumb upset. Seems around the ranch he's made himself a star. Nah, I'm not really worried, but you know, the way she carried on, I better find him. You know how women are. Well, I phoned all the neighbors and I backtracked to the camp and I've called for him and my throat is sore and, and I really wouldn't bother, but uh, you know, I, I like the little cuss. Just a minute, Joe. There's some. There's someone at the door. <laughs> yeah, I'm glad you're back. Yeah, you're a good dog. Yeah. Hey, Joe. You'll never guess. <laughs> Ma, come take a look at this. He's back. Say, hey, Joe. I'll see you at the Brandon, huh? You crazy little booger. Come get Daddy's lap. <laughs> see you, Joe, and hey, Joe, thanks for understanding. This is Baxter Black and Sweetie from out there. <laughs>